Hey, Alan here again, and we're going to continue with our Q&As. Now I want to talk about bindings and what bindings to choose to go with your skin base skis. We definitely recommend choosing an EA binding. Here I have the EA 2.0 Universal Binding. And the biggest benefit that you're going to get with our binding is that you can use a normal winter or trekking boot of your choice. So that's going to mean that you don't have to have a pair of dedicated ski boots. You don't have to worry about bringing those along with you. You can end up driving and walking and skiing all in the same boot, which is a really nice thing. Of course, if you want to go with a dedicated ski binding and use a dedicated ski boot, it's totally possible to do with our skis. And it's getting common, especially amongst our XCD line. So something like a three pin classic Telemark binding to go with a leather boot or a low cut plastic cuff boot is also a good choice. It gives you a little bit more control. Um, and you can also use NNN bindings, especially the NNN BC. So if you already own a pair of ski boots and you're not worried about it and you want a little bit extra edge, then that's a good option for you. Other bindings, you can use kind of 75 millimeter Telemark bindings. These are also acceptable. Or if you really want, you can use a two pin Tecto AT binding. Things that don't really work well are full Alpine bindings with like a full frame or NTN bindings. We kind of want to avoid that. It will work, but it kind of goes against the vision of the product, which is to make a nice lightweight setup that you can kind of roll around in. So I hope this helps and uh, stick around for the next one.